Um, and the three, uh, three awards that are chosen by our players are, are MVP, MIP, and Oil Can. The other awards we coaches chime in on, but those three awards I'll save for last, uh, but those are chosen by the players. Now, obviously, if we don't think they're right on, we're going <laughs> to have a revoke. But, um, but it, the, the, the players that um, are chosen by us as far as special teams player of the year, defensive player of the year, offensive player of the year, scout team player of the year, those are chosen by the coaches. And so we'll go through some of those awards now. Uh, but we have, we have, these guys, uh, when, when I call you up, you can applaud them. And then um, the, there are plaques for the MIP, MVP, and, and uh, Oil Can, as well as um, the Defensive Player of the Year. But for the rest of these, there's not, there's not an actual trophy. But um, this year, our uh, key kid for us and, and, um, was uh, for our scout team in preparing us for each game uh, was chosen from uh, all the team, uh, Lucas DeForge. Huh? You, can, you can stay up here, Lucas. Our um, special teams player of the year chosen by the coaches goes to Scotty Rule. This year's um, Defensive Player of the Year, uh, I mean, letter team tackles. I've never had that happen as a defensive end, uh, Brendan Kroll. <laughs> Our Offensive Player uh, of the Year um, it has Obviously, I told you, broke a, a number of records this year for single game rushing, uh, Davis Ike. <laughs> and um, this year, <laughs> the Oil Can Award goes to the, the young man chosen by the team that keeps everybody loose. And I think based on some of the comments that were said from the, from the podium up here tonight, you can figure out who this guy is. But um, this year's Oil Can Award goes to Matt Wilson. <laughs> the, the next award is our most improved player. Uh, we call it the MIP, and, and this guy, this guy tends to, to be a guy that really made huge um, uh, strides from his junior to his senior year, or from his sophomore to his junior year, and they they tend to be guys that um, didn't start the year before, and all of a sudden they're a key player for us in in the the season, and this year's. MIP uh, goes to AJ Hooper. <laughs> Most valuable player uh, for this year um, is, um, well, the, the guy who played both sides of the football, was an outstanding football player for us. I mentioned a lot of his offensive stats, broke a number of records. Um, only a junior, and uh, most valuable player this year goes to Davis Ife. <laughs> uh, guys, you can sit down. Congratulations. Nice job this year. <laughs> Our season stats guys are right here afterwards if you want to grab one. Also, Mr. DeForge has a, uh, like a 12 minute video. Yeah, about right? 12 minutes. Huh? Of the season, if you guys want to stay around and watch it. Uh, if not, it's fine. If you want to leave, I just want to say um, thank you, uh, coaches. You 
did a great job this year. You ask a lot of them, and, and the time commitment is is crazy. It's seven days a week, starting basically in, in August 8th, on August eighth, and, um, and it is a lot of work. It, but um, these guys uh, love Gaylord football. Uh, a lot of them played here, and were were great players here, uh, and have you know determined that they want to come back and give back to to the young men uh, that are involved in our program. And so I do really appreciate each one of you guys, and, and it's so much fun. It's not often that you have a staff that you just love to hang out with and be with in staff meetings. Um, oftentimes, at least in our offensive staff meetings, we're laughing so hard at something uh, Mike Wolford said or, or, or uh, Coach Bartow or, or whatever. It's just, uh, it can be a lot of fun. Uh, to be together and so it makes those hours that we spend together a lot more fun and just a lot more enjoyable to be uh, there. Um, but um, we're going to uh, show this video and then, and then um, you're welcome to, to get on out here. Thanks again for coming tonight uh, and thank you for honoring each one of these uh, young people tonight.